What's going on everybody? Resale Rabbit here. This is gonna be a quick little tip for you. <clears throat> so I picked up this joystick. It's the Logitech Freedom 2.4 gigabit or gigahertz, whatever. I'm not a tech guy. Joystick. It's in the original box. I paid five bucks for it at Goodwill. I think I can get about 30 or 40 dollars for it. It's got the receiver. This is a wireless one. But how do you test it? I'm gonna show you how to test any joystick that you can plug into a computer. Obviously the old ones, if you can't plug it into your computer, you might need some adapters, but as long as you can plug it into your computer, I'm gonna show you how to test it. Let me swing you over to my screen here. This is a website called html5gamepad.com. Now, if you look at the screen there, zoom in a little bit. If you look at the screen, it's got a series of buttons on here. And I'll take my joystick here. When I pull the trigger, see how one of them lights up? Push that button, another one lights up. This is telling you if each button works. That, you can see the axis on the top right there is changing. When I rotate this, I'm getting out of focus here, but when I rotate this, you can see the axis one and two are changing. I'm sorry, axis zero and one are changing. When I rotate this way, axis five is changing. With this little thing here, you look, axis, what is that, six is changing. I'm out of screen. I'm trying to look at my phone, the joystick, and my screen at the same time. But you see how that's changing? Push the buttons, and those light up. So it's very simple. Now in this particular joystick, zoom you out here and get you back to my chair. On this particular joystick, it is wireless, so I had to you know, plug in the receiver, but on many others, you could just plug it you know, right into the computer if it's a wired joystick. But that is how you test it. That's how you know that the buttons work. You just you know, do it right in there. I would imagine a PS3 controller or really any other controller that's USB, you would be able to test it in the same way on here. Maybe even Bluetooth controllers and whatnot. But that is how you're gonna test a joystick. So if you ever find any joystick and you wanna know if it works, check it out, html5gamepad.com. I'm not affiliated with this website. I just did some Google searching and found it. So that's, that, that's how, that's my only affiliation, Googling. So anyways, check out that website. I've done some searching, couldn't really find much else. There was one website I found that actually had a display of video game controllers, GameCube, NES, so on and so forth, and you could push the buttons and it would tell you if it's working. You'd likely need some sort of adapter for it to work on that site. Um, I would imagine, you, well, you would need an adapter for them to work on any site. But I didn't see anything about this. I could not test this on that website. I don't remember what it was. This is the one that I found works. As I'm holding this, the axis is moving a little bit and it's freaking out a little bit on, on the screen. Uh, but that is how you test it. So hope this video helped, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one.